Mo or Cops Hate Mo is a non-binary YouTuber. He wants to, if he wasn't a pacifist, wants to curb stomp me. I saw a tweet of someone making fun of Ariel Scarcella, and I was like, this is really childish. Sam Collins, a very famous trans YouTuber, did you like this tweet? This is seventh grade humor. And then Mo responded to Sam. Marcus is a very special kind of terrible. The kind of terrible that makes me want to give up pacifism just so I can curve stomp him in particular. Because English is not my first language, I needed to look up curve stomp. It's a form of assault in which a victim's mouth is forcefully placed on a curb and then stomped from behind, causing severe injuries and sometimes death. Then I wrote, Do you want to physically harm me? Dude. Then Mo responded, Not really, no. I'm a pacifist and I have better things to do with my time. This is what you call a joke, my dear chap. Yeah, he has better things to do with his time, yeah, I can tell. And then I responded, Well, obviously you spend some of your time on threatening me. Some people die from curb stump, but okay. Haha, <laughs> great joke. Mo made a new tweet responding to what I just said. Curb stumping might kill you, yes, but anti-trans legislations encouraged by the turf rhetoric you spread could kill thousands. Oh yeah, so we it's better that we kill me so I don't spread rhetoric that could kill thousands. Yeah, that's that's good. That's a great form of activism. Yeah, I can see that. So Mo admits that this is something that could kill me and he said that he hypothetically wants to do this to me. Is that called a death threat then? What I don't understand is that he thinks that me just talking about my opinions could kill thousands, so that's why it's okay to kill me. First you're threatening me with violence, and then you claim my opinions can kill people. You're absolutely pathetic. Love how you say you have better things to do, yet here we are. And then we have to talk about what he wrote and other people wrote for him. It's funny that people get so mad at a little 5-5 me joking about curb stumping someone. I've said multiple times I'm a pacifist. I'd never actually hurt anyone, but bigots annoy me so I'll joke about it. I thought we were the snowflakes. Stop being so sensitive and take a joke. Mo, sweetie, it does not matter how big you are, how, how tall you are, you can't threaten someone online. That's kind of against the law. I'm obviously not threatened by you. You are responsible for what you say. When you say, I'd never actually hurt anyone. That is so irrelevant because if you say, I want to hurt you, I don't care what your intentions are actually, it's about what you're saying at the moment. That's how the law works. But bigots annoy me, so I'll joke about it. Could you imagine Ariel Scarcella saying on Twitter that she wants to curve jump a non-binary person because she disagrees with them? How do you think that will be received? Stop being so sensitive and take a joke. I get it, you don't want to hurt me. I, 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 get, I get your intentions. Again, if you say something that's on the fence to being illegal, I'm gonna make a video about it. I'm gonna comment on it, okay? I'm not sensitive. I'm just trying to make sure that we're all civil. You, can, you and I can have disagreements. You have been on Rose of Dawn's show. You've been on my buddy Mars's show, where, as I remembered, you had a civil conversation. But this is not a civil conversation. You joking about wanting to kill me. I cannot believe I'm making this video though. Marcus, why are you even making a video about it? Just ignore him. Just move on. Well, I, I am gonna after this video. But this person has 80,000 subscribers. 80,000s. Going after me. Why? Why is that? Should I say it now or should I save it for another video where I talk about other trans YouTubers? Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it. Uh, here and I'm gonna make another video about this why big fishes are going uh, after little fishes I am talking about this because this person has many thousands of followers 
and I find it really troubling that it's allowed on Twitter. I did report this tweet if you uh, if you're wondering, how is that allowed? Again, if Buck Angel, if Blair White, if um, Ariel Scarcella, they made the same tweet, they would be banned. This is they them privilege. That is all I have. Mo, if you're watching, why don't you block me? That's kind of, you block my friends, <laughs> but you don't block me. It's because you want to keep watching my content. Well, you are more than welcome. Thank you for watching this video. Please let me know what you think in the comments down below and see you in my next video where I'm probably, I think this is going to be my next video where I'm probably going to talk about trans YouTubers going to the far left. Peace out.